Hi guys, this is my first time reacting to a gotcha um movie. This is voice acted, so yeah. Um this is called Behind the Mask. Um I don't know who made this, but I hope you're okay with me reacting to this. Please just be okay with reacting this or <laughs> to this. Uh, I have my headphones on, so if it sounds a little obnoxious or loud, that is why. All right, let me press the button. Nation. Cedric Vanberg. Okay, so this is already going nuts, though. I cannot believe it. And from that day on, I became a legend. A legend? Um, what? <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I love this scene. Lady Trinity, it's time to wake up. Oh, she... I love her outfit. I just love it already. You're heading to the palace to meet Prince Cedric. A palace? Uh... You see, I was not a very bright child. In fact, I was the perfect lady back then. Poi. Back to then? <laughs> In the olden days? Okay, okay, I'll shut up, I'll shut up. Mannered, educated, and elegant. But I had no passion. Alright, miss. I'll get your bath ready. You- She gets to have a- She gets to have someone get a bath for her? You know what? I'm jealous. I am jealous. Look lovely, miss. Your father is waiting for you outside. She is fabulous. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. Me and my father had a very complex and distant relationship. I do not know what that We disagreed means. on most things, but we still respected each other. <laughs> Hello, your grace. <laughs> Good morning, Your Trinity. grace. And then he's like... And then he's like... Mm. And the carriage is waiting for us outside. <laughs> when we get to the palace, remember to treat the crown prince with respect. Yes. With respect. <laughs> Why am I doing this? I cannot take this seriously. Your grace. May I present my daughter Trinity of the House Lamone? It is an honor to be in your presence, Your Majesty and Highness. What a lovely young lady. I have heard many great things about you, Lady Trinity. I am honored to hear that. This is Cedric, my son. <laughs> the Crown Prince of the Nation, Cedric Barnberg, was going to be my soon-to-be fiancé. He was 16 at the time, and I was only 13. Nice to meet you, Lady Trinity. It is normal for nobles to be married at a young age, sometimes as early as ten years old. The women of noble families spend their lives learning to become the best wife for their husband, learning how to host social events, embroidery, and things to support their husband. What does broider, broidery? What what does that mean? Men of noble families learn to become the next head of their house, or become someone successful to bring honor to their noble house. I must excuse myself. My personal tutor will be arriving soon. It was a pleasure meeting you, Lady Trinity. The pleasure is all yours. Huh. Perhaps I should get up and walk for a bit. Yeah, sure. Oh, I didn't see you there. Sorry if I disturbed you, sir. Oh, that's all right. I bet you were just curious. I've just been exploring the palace. It's huge, isn't it? <laughs> I'm Trinity. Host La Monet, I didn't realize I was talking to Lady Trinity. I apologize. I would have been more mannered. I'm Kari, head of the Knights of Vanderberg, as well as His Highness's sword coach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oops, I, I that sword tapping. is truly elegant in the light. It was crafted by the best blacksmith in our nation. What a beauty. Want to give it a try? 
Huh? She clearly <laughs> has a tr crush. Clearly, clearly, clearly. I have not watched this before, but I know it. I just know it. Excuse me, but I'm a lady. It's forbidden. Anyone can wield a sword, even a woman. I must politely refuse. I understand. Now I must get back to my work. It was an honor meeting you. He said anyone can wield a sword. Perhaps I could too. A little try wouldn't hurt anyone. I had never felt anything as good as this. Wielding such a weapon made me feel in a way I had never felt before. That is thrill! It is called a thrill! From the blade of this sword, a legend would be born. I cannot read that. Miss, are you not worried that Princess Talia might take your fiancé away from you? I, in fact, actually approve of that marriage. It will strengthen our ties with the Kingdom of Divine anyways. What? What? What is she saying? Am I supposed to understand this? <laughs> you really changed over these past few years. The young emotionless miss I used to know has grown into a strong woman. <laughs> Will you ever tell anyone about your identity? As the Masked Knight? Every sword's master fears you. But yet, they don't know the beautiful young lady behind the mask. <sighs> How I wish I could reveal my identity. Why did I just but what would they think of a swordswoman? <sighs> You're right. It's best to keep this a secret. Much had happened between the four secret. years. Da, da, da. In fact, after wielding that sword for the first time, I began to watch Kari teaching Cedric from a distance to learn the sword myself. After learning the basics, I searched the city for someone who would teach me the sword. Guys, that's All of them rejected me due to one reason. I was a woman. So I put myself in a mask and wore men's clothes and tried again. They accepted me at a first glance. That is why it is called Behind the Mask! After training for years, I had competed in many tournaments and won them all. My name was feared amongst all swordsmen, and the only one who knew my identity was Laura. My maid who was just like a mom to me. Lady Trinity, Wait, did you hear? Talia spent the night in His Highness's bedroom last night! <gasps> That's horrible, Lady Trinity! Aren't you his rightful fiancé? It's nothing new. I have known for a while that Princess Talia might become his fiancé and- And you're alright with this? Yes. Our marriage was only going to work if there weren't going to be any political marriages. Then... What will you do if Princess Talia takes His Highness away from you? <clears throat> Pardon me, ladies. I must speak to Lady Trinity privately. Oh, what's that? What do you need, Your Highness? Have you heard of the upcoming hunting event? Yes. All the nobles and well-known swordsmen would be there to participate. Yes, I have heard. I need you to accompany me at the event. But I was going to go as the mask tonight. You know I don't like hunting events. <sighs> I know, but this is His Majesty's request. I must refuse. Perhaps you could ask Princess Talia to accompany you. Princess Talia isn't my fiancé. She will be. <sighs> Why must you be so stubborn? Do you that badly not want to be- She just doesn't want to, dude! Just let it out. Ignore her. Or possibly even walk away if she doesn't want to. I mean, I wouldn't even harass her. She would just. She just said no. She just said no. That's fine. Be with me. I have things to attend to. Fine. Be like that. I guess I will ask Princess Talia. <laughs> Acting like a two year old! <laughs> Two-year-old of the year. 
Honestly, Look, ladies, it's the Masked Knight. Oh, God, this is so weird. They think I'm a man. <laughs> Welcome, Masked Knight. It's an honor to have you here. Thank you, Your Highness. <laughs> that just sounded like a demon. <laughs> Soon to be fiance, Princess Talia. It's a pleasure to meet you, Masked Knight. I've heard a lot about you and your skills. Why do I feel a tiny pang of sadness? Is it because I've been friends with Cedric since I was 13 and... Soon we will break apart? You are an amazing swordsman. So many people wonder who you are behind the mask. Thank you, but your highness is just as good a swordsman as me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be modest. The event will start soon. Whomever brings back the best game will be the honored guest of the event. My only competition here is Cedric. I would win otherwise. <laughs> Who do you think will win the event? His Highness is the expected winner. It would really impact his reputation if someone else wins. I believe my darling His Highness should easily win this. But the Max Knight might win this. I know! Isn't he the dream husband? I wonder who he is behind the mask. She! It's a she! Not he! Alright. I must find the Golden Beast. It's the biggest and hardest game to kill. I feel its presence. Its presence? A bear? Great! A bear. He's here too? Don't think for a second I'll just let you have the game I fought for, too. That's alright, because I wasn't planning on letting you have it, either. Oh! Ugh. Ugh, I don't like the noises! How long did we fight for? I must bring this back, now! And the winner is... The Masked Knight! Do it! Do it! Do it! Uh, I'm sorry, Father. I've brought shame to our name. No, son, you did well. You aren't the problem. It's the Masked Knight. Sadly, it is. But I can't do anything about it. I respect his sword abilities as another swordsman. Hmm. That's very mature of you. But I need you to find out who the Masked Knight is. I'll let this one win for the Masked Knight slide. But the next time there is a public event like that, we must ensure that the Crown Prince looks strong and capable, more than anything. I understand, Father. No, no, you do not understand. Whoops. Alright. It should be safe to take off my mask now. Uh. Trinity! Uh oh. Um. Is there a part two? Oh, that's you. it. Well, subscribe to whoever this is. That was very unexpected. If you guys enjoyed that video and you enjoyed me reacting to it, please give this video a like and make sure you also subscribe. Click that notification bell for more really weird videos that I make. Um, I don't know how to give you the fur, the, the full, the, uh, uh, I can't talk, the, um, original version, but it is called, um, Behind the Mask. Um, whoever this person is, subscribe to them too. I loved this so far. Um, yeah. Bye.